Why didn't I listen? Oh, man. I gotta get to work on these leaks. Hey guys, we are in St. Augustine, Florida. This has always been one of my real favorite spots. I'm gonna go for a bike ride here. And, uh, but I, you know, I'm not really feeling it this time. Uh, been here about two, three days and uh, I don't really find it to be, I don't really find it to be like it used to be. Um, it's just gotten so busy. Tons of things have changed here since I was here with my bus. And I think I'm going to get out of here Monday morning. I'm going to hang out today and watch the football game at uh, Buffalo Wild Wings, I think, tomorrow. Which I, uh, you know, I always like to do that on Sundays. <clears throat> but I'm going to get out of here. I, I just, I'm not feeling it. Um, it's, it's, uh, there's so much of the homeless population here. Which has always been the case, but it's like you pull in with the camper and you kind of go in to a place to do interneting or whatever, and you just get these funny looks. And I don't know, I don't find that to be any other places, but but I find it to be here. As I just say, I just you know that's what I like about traveling and being able to kind of up and go or whatever. You know, if I don't like the thing, I turn the key and move on. And uh, this used to be one of my, this used to be my favorite, one of my, it was, was one of my top favorite places, but I ain't feeling it at all. But I'm going to try and go for a bike ride, see if that clears my head a little bit, and uh, we'll film a little bit. Um, it, it's a cool town. It's a great town to, to visit and stuff, but uh, I don't know. One of the, this is one of the secret little spots, I guess. They have a, they say by permit only at $35 a night to stay here. And I don't think they ever enforce that is what I'm understanding is it probably people were like, I, I'm not paying $35 to park my rig with no amenities whatsoever. No, no uh, water, no toilet, no electric, no nothing. So that's kind of my assumption is, is that's what's maybe happened is, is they've just, uh, they've just done it and whatever there's two these two rigs there's there's this rig and there's another one on the other side they both have been here since yesterday and they have not moved so obviously they're staying i don't see any permits on their window or whatever but anyway i'm gonna get for a go for a ride because uh i do enjoy bike riding around st augustine so um and you know you can see over here's um, some of the homeless guys or whatever you want to call them uh um, you know, these guys travel on their bikes and live, you know, and there's just, there is a boatload of them around here. And, uh, anyway, I'm going to get going. So this is down in Old Town in, uh, St. Augustine. And if you ever do get a chance, um, one time when I was here, as I said, I was here with my school bus and one of the, uh, guys gave me a free ticket for that. And it's, uh, it's amazing at, uh, how much you learn on that thing it's uh, crazy but anyway this is the old town and they built these streets um, very very uh, uh, small and, and kind of closed uh, closed in like this uh, purposely for the uh, wind the wind will funnel down through here the breeze and it kind of kept the bugs away back in the day um, and it's fun down through here in the evenings. There's a lot of uh, really good uh, bands playing, a uh, little one-man or two-man bands. I didn't want to. I didn't want to talk about it on film over there, but 
um, again, you can see all the homeless that, uh, and I think that's what's happened here, is I think they've just kind of, the people and stuff have gotten very uh, tired of it and disgusted with it, and it seems that that's the stigma. And like I said, I've just made my decision for sure that uh, I'm out of here as of uh, as of Monday. Uh, I'm gonna get I'm gonna get myself going. Uh, uh, I, I'm not feeling this place at all, and I'm gonna I'm gonna find uh, another place and another uh, uh, area to kind of you know to kind of showcase and stuff because there's other places and stuff like that. So anyway, we'll talk to you later. So we are on the other side of the Lionsgate Bridge and this is probably the majority of where most of the sailboats lay in here, um, <clears throat> do the anchorage and that. Uh, we anchored when we came down through the intercoastal, we anchored kind of up in there and uh, we just spent a couple of nights and then uh, uh, moved on or whatever. But, uh, but anyway, there's a good pile of them up in here and I'm sure they're up and around the corner. But uh, anyway, I got kicked out of that place I don't know I went into their parking lot and he got all over me so I don't know what I did wrong there but anyway we'll continue on with our little trip just met up with this fellow over here His name is Joe and we're gonna try and catch up and have a beer chit chat about his little uh, unit he's been traveling about three years and uh, anyway you had seen uh, anyway I've got the tribe over here all Snugged in over here. This one's actually for sale that big red one, which is uh, man. That's uh, that is the boat to uh, That's the boat to have um, People always say oh, you know you need the small boat and small boat small boat and that's fine But I actually like I said I would like to have with my ability. I'd like to have a large enough boat to uh, take my captain's license and take people out for some sales and uh, maybe even an anchorage and an overnight and stuff and you know, try and make a few dollars while I'm, you know, doing what I love to do. I, I don't know. That's the way I look at it. You can't do it on a little 27-foot boat. It's just not gonna, not gonna work. You know, um, a bigger boat just attracts uh, that kind of a, the kind of people you need to uh, make a few dollars while you're doing it. So anyway. Yeah, it's kind of a pretty day. We had rain, and uh, of course, you guys seen that the camper was the weekend. I got to fix all that to tomorrow, probably. It's supposed to be dry all the rest of the week, so I'll work on that. Okay, guys, appreciate you watching my videos. Uh, don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to share, like, comment, and we will see you guys on the water soon. Thanks. Peace out.